Hello and welcome back to the channel. So today I am doing something that I haven't done for a very long time and that's pretty much just talking about something because it's been way too long since I last did that. Uh, so today we're accompanied by my medieval era snack, uh, tomato from the garden, uh, cookie from the garden and anchovies from the garden too, mm, yes. And of course our water. More scrumptious than any snack could hope to be. But anyway, anyway, a little bit off topic. But okay, so today I was on a bike ride going around just by myself because I got a bit bored and my friends are usually pretty busy. So I decided, you know, uh, I'm just going to I'm just going to go out just alone today and, you know, I'm going to have a blast. I'm going to have a great time. I'm going to go to the aquarium that's near me and I'm just going to go around and I'm going to look at stuff. Yeah, you, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna really look at stuff. Anyway, so I, believe it or not, went to the aquarium and, believe it or not, looked at stuff. But I only went to the aquarium after I got some food to eat and my god, it was great. It was some kind of like mince roll. Holy shit, it was bussin' like, like no tomorrow, man. This mince roll, I tell you what, it was made with like grandma level love and care. Like, it was great. Anyway. I went to the aquarium, and as I entered, I just looked around, and it was cool as ever. I mean, I usually go there to buy something, so I had my wallet on me, and everything's always cooler when you're thinking of buying something, because everything is on the table except for anything expensive, which is some of the more prized fish, but I'm not looking for anything like that. I usually, I usually like the small ones. Anyway, I'm looking around, I'm just perusing the area. There's a reptile section, I go to there, I look at that for a while, and as I pass a tank with discus in it, I sort of, I hear Greek. Now, being surrounded by Greek people for a lot of my life, still am, I pretty much, well, I understand it almost as well as English, with a few exceptions here and there, but, uh, namely, Greek news reporters. I'll, I'll, I'll link some news reporters down below because, like, holy shit, they talk. They're giving Eminem a run for his money. Anyway, so I hear Greek, just 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 faintly, and I'm looking around because I'm always assuming it's going to be some old woman who sounds like a man because she smoked way too many cigarettes and also because she probably has more testosterone than one, being a Greek woman at all. Anyway. I, I'm looking around and I'm not really noticing anyone, so I just walk into one of the aisles with a bunch of fish tanks and I'm looking around just because I like looking at fish. What can I say? I like watering all the animals inside of it. Um, but pretty much. Mmm. Bussin. Bussin. Now that's more than just person, that's gluttony. Anyway, so I don't notice this woman at first, but I, I still hear the Greek. I still hear a woman speaking Greek with a croaky voice, as expected. But I look around, and it's a teacher from Greek school. Now, I, I don't go to Greek school anymore, but I used to, and I have so many stories that I would, that I would like to tell here one day. Uh, preferably when I'm out of the state and no one can find me, but I just, I shit myself. I'm like, oh my, no, 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 this is not what I bargained for. I, I came here to look at fish, not to get, I don't know, yelled at by one of my Greek school teachers. Anyway, whether she was going to yell at me or not, I had to hide. So... I'm looking around, I'm looking for a spot, like, I'm, genu I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely trying to, like, evade her at this point. So, I walk into a section where there's a bunch of, like, there's a, there's a few aisles where it's just full of, like, products and stuff, like fish food and all that. And I'm able to evade her for a solid, like, 20 minutes. Because I, I want to stay in there and look at stuff. But I also don't want her to look at me. Because I just can't be bothered dealing with that today. Anyway. So, I'm pretty much, I'm stealth in this, th this shit, okay? But yeah, she doesn't really see me, and if she does, then I definitely didn't know about it. Um, so, 
I was just kind of confused, like I was expecting it to go wrong, but it didn't. So anyway, after about this this whole 40 minute ordeal, I figure, well, I have to buy something, anything. And I would have bought a new fish tank if I had room in my bag. I was just riding there on my bike and I came with my bag. So I couldn't exactly buy a fish tank as much as it hurt my heart to not. I only have one. Um, it's, it's, it's relatively small. It's like that by that. It's, 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 a, it's a cube. And, ooh, sorry. Anyway, you want to know what I bought? Hang on. And this is only something you can get excited about in the, in the aquarium hobby. But I bought a bag of rocks. Let's go. Look at that. It's a bag of rocks. Oh, that's 40 minutes well spent. Um, <laughs> it's okay. All, all jokes aside, the rocks are pretty cool. It's called dragon stone or dragon rock. And it looks fucking hot. Like that looks sexy. I'll definitely showcase um, the tank where I put it in, in like maybe half a year's time when I get another fish tank. But they look good. There's some sexy rocks. Was it worth 40 minutes? Absolutely. Was it worth the stress of evading a Greek school teacher that probably would have had my head on a plate? Absolutely it was. Anyway, that's my uh, seven minute ordeal about pretty much nothing happening. So uh, I hope you en <laughs> I hope you enjoyed if you've stayed around this long. Uh, thanks. What can I say? Love you. Or thank you. Bye. Goodbye.